All righty, welcome back. Well, court-appointed special advocates are volunteers who work with children in the foster care program and represent them as needed. CASA is a program with the 8th Judicial District Court, and volunteers are needed today. There's also a program that calls for support from local businesses as well in several different ways. So to talk more about that, we have Champions for CASA President Jennifer Page, who is also a volunteer for CASA. So you are very much involved in all this. So you are the best person to tell us <laughs> all the things that we need to know about CASA. So tell us about the program. Sure. So. Uh the court-appointed special advocates work with kids living in foster care and really advocate for them throughout the court system as well as throughout their lives. So work with doctors, teachers, lawyers, anybody in their lives to make sure that their best interests are being met. Wonderful. And I know the big message today is you need businesses, businesses to get involved and help. How are the different ways that they can do that? Yeah, we're asking businesses to become a corporate champion. So really there's three ways that they can do that. So they can uh, help us spread awareness. So invite us into local businesses, meet with employees, clients, vendors, whoever in their circle so that we can tell more about our program, get more people to get involved. Um, that's the biggest way. We are also a 501c3, so financial support is critical for us. So that's always very helpful. And I'd say the third way is in-kind support. So our volunteers actually take the kids out in the community so that they can have the experiences like all the other children in our community and they do that out of their own pockets mm -hmm. and so any local businesses that might be able to offer support and invite kids in to go bowling go to the movies go do things in the community that they might be able to help with that would be fantastic wonderful and you are a volunteer yourself so you are you know with the kids taking them out on outings and whatnot what is it about this that is so rewarding for you well well the impact that we have on these kids mm -hmm. I mean you see firsthand every time every single time I'm with my kids I get to see exactly what a difference I'm able to make. Um, kids that have a CASA volunteer have so much better outcomes in life. You know, they do better in school, they are, have a greater chance of becoming adopted themselves, and they really have a hope. Mm -hmm. You know, they really get to dream about what their future can look like, and I get to experience that with them every single time I'm with them. So, I love that. Yeah. And how can people become a volunteer themselves? Yeah, so you can go to championsforcasa.org. That is our website. Learn more about it. Um, we support the Casa Las Vegas program that's run through the 8th Judicial, um, but it's pretty simple. Go to an informational session, learn a little bit more, go through your background checks, go through training, and then get out there and help some kids. And is that the same website people can go if they want to volunteer themselves as well? Absolutely. I'm we sorry. do links through. If the businesses yeah. want to be a part, is that the same website? It is. Absolutely. Okay. Yep. And what type of businesses are you looking for to get involved? Yeah. I mean, anybody, anybody that wants to make a difference. It's all about awareness. I think the more people know and understand, there's really 3,200 kids living here in foster care in Southern Nevada. So uh, the more we can get that word out. So businesses, small, big, anyone can really make a difference. And then how long have you been a volunteer? I've been in the program for about five and a half years. Okay, so quite some time. Yeah. And so clearly this is something that is a big part of your life. Yeah. Why is that? Yeah. Um, you know, my why, I actually came from a background myself where mm -hmm. I could have used some help. And I feel like giving that voice to those children is really something that is absolutely priceless to me, making sure that they know that they're represented. Um, we tell our volunteers the biggest thing they can do to make a difference is just be consistent. Mm -hmm. Just show up for those kids. It makes such a difference. All right. Well, Jennifer, yeah. thank you so much. And give us that website one more time. Yeah, it's championsforcasa.org. Okay. Jennifer, thank you so much. Thank you.